Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to install the torque arm kit included in e-bike link conversion kits. Torque arms are always recommended when converting any bike into an e-bike with a hub motor. Its job is to prevent damage to your frame by spreading the torque from the axle to other parts of your frame other than your dropouts. I recommend a torque arm for any hub motor with 500 watts of power or more. For anything 1500 watts or more, I'd recommend two torque arms. Torque arms can be mounted on the chain side or the non-chain side, it doesn't matter but it is generally easier to work on the non-chain side. I'll start off by installing one torque arm on the non-chain side for a rear hub motor. This is what comes with the torque arm kit. Slide on the first piece of the arm, and then loosely bolt together the second piece. Now install and tighten the axle nut. Then fully tighten the second piece of the arm while making sure the arm is resting on the chainstay. Now take the hose clamp and loop it through the slot in the arm and around the chainstay. Tighten the clamp and then you're done. On a side note, if you're installing an e-bike motor without a waterproof connector, you may need to depin the big white connector so the washer, nut, and torque arm can pass through. Next, I'm going to install a torque arm onto a front hub motor. First, slide this C-shaped washer to fill the space in the fork where the quick release will normally sit into. Then slide on the first piece of the torque arm. Then loosely bolt together the second piece of the torque arm. Now open up the hose clamp and loop it through the slot in the arm and around the fork, lightly securing it. Install and tighten the axle nut. And then fully tighten the second piece of the arm while making sure the arm is resting on the fork. Tighten the clamp and then you're done. If you're worried about the finish on your frame of fork, cut a piece of an old tire tube and tape it to the frame of fork with electrical tape. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.